Hey, what's up guys? So time for a quick update uh, regarding the unit in R8 and specifically uh, some of the initial reliability issues that we saw with the first batch of R8s uh, leading to some display failures. <laughs> Now, after the R8 was launched, for most people, the detectors were working properly, uh, but around 25% of people, from what we saw uh, on a poll on RDF, uh, actually had some display failures where the display actually stopped working properly. Now, luckily, Uniden ultimately did wind up making customers right with uh, sending out replacement shipping labels to get the detectors back, and then sending out replacement detectors uh, for people who had affected issues, or affected detectors. Uh, now, I've had a chance to actually talk with Uniden about it, and they said that they've identified the issue and the initial batch of R8s, and the second batch of detectors that have since already gone out uh, have the fix implemented, so the uh, latest detectors being shipped out no longer have that issue. And again, as far as reports that I've been seeing on the forums and talking to you guys online, it looks like for the most part that yes, the issue has now since been addressed. I am still seeing occasionally some people reporting issues, but it looks like that was actually from the initial batch of detectors. And so uh, as far as what the issue is, I don't have the exact details on what the issue is. It looks like the unit has identified the issue and resolved it. So now if you go and purchase an R8, it looks like the display failure issue has finally been resolved. So just a quick update to let you guys know about that. And if you go look online on Amazon, for example, it looks like Uniden does finally have a solid supply of inventory of R8s. And so if you'd like to purchase one online, I'll have links in the video descriptions to where you can pick one up. Uh, if you'd like information as far as how to set up the detector, as far as different settings and programming options, I've got an article on my website. Uh, I'll link to that down in the video description as well that explains all the different settings. And at the bottom, uh, goes over my recommended settings, as well as the settings that I run personally on my R8 as well. And so, yeah, updated R8s have actually been shipping out for a while. And so just wanted to do a quick uh, follow-up video to let you guys know about uh, kind of what's been going on since then. And to say that, yeah, it looks like fortunately a uh, Uniden has uh, addressed the issue. And so that's it for now. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you're all doing great. And I'll see you in the next video.